Rabbeinu Yehina in Shari Tshuva points out a dikduk in the Pesukim and Tehillim that speak about David HaMelech's incredible level of Tshuva. David HaMelech says, Palge mayim yerdu enai, fountains of water, my eyes flow, tears are flowing from my eyes, Allah shomru teira secho, for not guarding your teira. And Rabbeinu Yehina says, why does it say leish shomru? It should say leish shomati. And he says, the eyes that did not keep Torah are the eyes that have to flow with tears. I'd like to add a thought based on two stories that happened with our great Rosh Hashiva Rabaran in Florida. One story was that he came to Florida for an appointment with a wealthy man and he had time while he was staying in the hotel. I'd say he had an hour or two or more and immediately he asked for a pen and paper and started writing furiously. And he was writing and writing and writing and the Bocha who was accompanying him, Reb Leibish Prostowski, said at one point, Was schreibt the Rosh Hashiva as I feel? What is the Rosh Hashiva writing so much? And he said, These are Chidushi Torah from 40 years ago that I haven't yet had a chance to put down on paper. This is like mind-boggling. 40 years, and this was not a regular 40 years. The world had rolled over in those 40 years. He'd lost hundreds of Talmidim in those 40 years. And yet, the Torah in his mind was engraved in his heart and he was capable of putting it down on paper 40 years later. The second story is that he came out of an elevator in a hotel in Florida and as he came out, as the Gemara calls it, Bekaren Zavis, he saw a lady who was very not sneistically dressed. He was so agitated that he literally started crying uncontrollably. And his words were incredible words. What did I sin that you allowed me to see a Re'iyat Meir like this? What a beautiful level of Kedusha that we can only aspire to have a connection with. But Rabbi Sai, I believe these two stories go together. To hold on to the Kedusha that we have, to remember the Torah that we've learned. The eyes are the Shemrim, are the gods of our Torah. If we want the lid of our Torah to be secure, the eyes have to be vigilant in their shmira. Palge mayim yedu ainai. The eyes cry Allah shamru because they did not guard Torah secha. Every little bit of shmira seinayim gives us an extra shmira for our Torah, which is so precious. We should all be zeicha to great madregas kol echad lefi madregoseh.